Sasha and his new girl have broken up, I guess. For some of you who don't know, Sasha has, for a few months, has had this girl called uh, Monet. He has a new girlfriend, as we've known, a new girlfriend. He's been chilling, posting vids, couple things and things of that nature. Even body my dog, apparently, and things like that. But... Right now, we hop on the internet and suddenly she posts something saying they broke up. So let's just get. She says a, 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 a speech or something right here. Hi guys, don't mind me looking up and down. I'm just reading what I wrote on my notes. So let's get started. She's got notes and things like that. Firstly, hello everybody. I'm doing this because I feel like I owe you guys an explanation. I don't like being turned into a fool that I'm not. I don't like being lied to belittled and disrespected i'm directing this message to you mister i think by now you know me you know what i like and don't like secondly you know i'm definitely not for the drama that you are trying to create the reason why i haven't been answering your texts is because you're taking this content thing way too far without considering other people's feelings and emotions I'm definitely not for it. I've taken a lot of backlash, hate, and bullying from social media. Personally, I feel like she could have said all of this in private. All of this could have been said in the text in private. We didn't need to know this. I know how the relationship was public, I get it. But all of this could have been said in private, like between her and the gent and Sasha. Because of this, luckily I know better. And I don't allow such to, such to define who I am. I know my worth and how a lady is supposed to carry themselves at all mm. times. Let me remind you that I have self-love, respect. Oh, bro, this music is throwing me off. It's so loud, bro. And my inner peace and reputation is of importance. At this point of time, I don't think relationships should be my concern. My clothing line and schoolwork is of importance. Mm. And thanks for reminding me. The reason why I'm doing this on social media is because our business is out there and I take full accountability for my part. Hence, I felt the need to explain myself. Somehow, you convinced me and manipulated me. You made me feel comfortable to do this whilst you were not honest with a lot of things. Your recent posts have somehow left a distasteful effect on me. I need to get into that. Your recent posts have less a distasteful effect to me. So, I think she's talking about this video right here. Bro, what's up to seeing this girl on this channel? You feel me, Sasha? Like, this girl, this girl and him, like, I, I, we've all gave up as a kind. You know, sometimes I just feel like doing, like, just clicking this button, but gotta let a black man shine, so I won't do that. Guy behind me is driving shit. What if you don't drive me shit? Money, not now. What's up? I feel like it. I don't know. I think it's dead. I don't know. That's the only post I found. Maybe I didn't do research well enough. But yeah, I feel like she got, she felt like she being used for content and stuff like that. Which I get her point. But girl, why are you writing a whole, this video, bro, her speech is five minutes long, bro. Why are you writing a whole speech? It, like, like you, you don't even do this for school. Bro. You should, this, if you put this energy for school, I'm telling you. Prosper, you prosper, bro. You be prosperous, bro. Cause this is not. It's very. Is this what I be saying for real? <laughs> it's very unnecessary, bro. You're putting the wrong amount. You you put a lot like this effort into the wrong things, bro. As you say, focus on your school, your clothing, bro, bro. Hey, I am not writing a five minute speech. I'll be dating Beyonce herself. I'm not writing a five minute speech telling her we're breaking up and things of that nature, bro. I'm calling and I'm telling her all this, bro. I'm not putting it online, bro. Why is she preparing this, bro? That nigga's in. Isn't he on his Deben something toy? He's having, he's enjoying life, bro. And you're hurting. That's the thing, bro. It's this girl saying they're dating and stuff like that. Here's what's going on for real. Sasha, are you not loyal? I am a very loyal person. We were just not dating. Wait, hold on, guys. Um, nah, we're not. Sasha, are you not loyal? I am a very loyal person. We were just not dating. So basically, it was for Cloud. Not mm. for my Cloud. I was helping her grow. I was just helping her grow. She wants to, she wanted to, be, she wants to be an influencer. My network's not working. So another YouTuber lying to us. Why is people staging so much things, bruh? This guy's saying he was helping her, bruh. So basically he never dated her. It's 
to what he claims he never dated her and it was for clout as he said they always capping these people's always lying bro now people are helping each other with clout paid promos now now it's gonna be paid career <laughs> I find that for a paid career, we'll be dating. YouTubers gotta stop lying to us. That's why I say content creation is not where it's supposed to be. We're not at, at our peak. That's why Americans don't recognize us like that, bro. Because we're just always capping and capping and, and we're not doing the most, but like, why is he doing this, bro? She wants to be an influencer, so I was helping her grow, bro. So you never dated her? Yeah, we have never dated. So if it wasn't for us working together, Maybe we would have dated. If we weren't working together, I, I think maybe we would have dated. There's a strong chance we would have dated, but we couldn't. It was business. And it works. You guys you guys can say everything you want. She's a good person. It worked. Look how many followers she has on Insta. And if, if it wasn't for this whole thing of making her seem like she was my hand, you guys wouldn't have followed her. You guys wouldn't have given a shit. It worked. Mm. So she's she isn't your crush. No, she's not my crush. I, I've, I've never had a crush. I've never had a crush, by the way. Yeah, bro, stop lying, bro. This nigga's lying, bro. He's lying. Everyone has had a crush. Let's be honest. So she's not she's not my crush. Was it for free? I can't answer that. She's yeah, very... so basically it's a paid promo. This guy did for me, they helped and stuff like that. Which is cool, you know what I'm saying? Getting his bag, stuff like that. My problem is, as I said, we won't like the People were misled into thinking they were together. Not that big. But why would you make a breakup video, all of this, and stuff like that, with a change you're not even with, bruh? She embarrassed herself for nothing, bro. They took out the news. They weren't together. I feel like they had an agreement, and then she ended up catching feelings and thinking it was gonna go somewhere, and then boom. Did he fake content? Not really. You feel me? There's no rules of making content. You feel me? There's no, there's nothing of. You're not supposed to. It's like goes through me. It's like there's no rule of him. There's no rules of dog. You don't supposed to fake videos stuff like. He's an entertainer at the end of the day. Even though he misleads us, like there's no rule of him like saying he mustn't do this. And then like, as I said for this, like for him, it's like this. I feel like it's far. Like it crossed the line because like bro, like now you fake like you like dog you all her people now like they from thinking you're like dating. They basically most of his audience. So now since he told them that no more dating, she's gonna lose traction, you feel me? And she's getting as she's gonna get more clowned online. But yeah, moral of the story is never chase mommies because why there's too many mommies. You'll never you end. will never child all the mommies. Please subscribe and like the video, like like it.